Alright, what's up guys, and today I'm going to be showing you how to get very, very nice color corrections in uh, Sony Vegas. I'm pretty sure it works in all Sony Vegas uh, versions. I, I know it works for 8 and up, uh, but we're going to be using the tool called Color Curves. Um, I'm sure probably all of you have heard of that. And so as long as your Sony Vegas version has that, and I know 8 and up does, then you'll be fine. Um... I'm going to be showing you how to do it all in Sony Vegas without plugins. Uh, and you know, a lot of people like to whore uh, magic bullet looks. And um, I have it. I know. I know I've used it a lot. A lot. Um, and it's, it's a nice program. It has a lot of tools in it and stuff. But again, um, if you're not a pirate, then you have to pay for it, first of all. And second of all, there's so many tools in it that almost every time you use it, you almost try and start going overboard and start to make your project um, look not as good um, and you know make it look kind of ugly so today I'm going to be showing you how to use only color curves to get some really really nice uh, color cor color corrections my bad guys so what I'm going to do is uh, just empty or drag in a clip and it's just a Gears of War clip I've been playing that a lot and I decided to record for some reason and yeah so um, this is what we're gonna be working with you can you can do it with obviously you can do it with anything um, you won't pro you probably won't be able to copy exactly my settings because different color corrections look better on different games so what you're gonna want to do is just once you have your clip in go over to your video effects and drag in a reset to none color curves and by the way if you um, if you didn't know you can drag it in to onto the side um, not just if you drag it into just a clip if I were to add another clip into here it wouldn't have that effect on it um, but if you drag it into let's delete this real quick if you drag it into the side um, the video effects or the video bar every single video in this bar will have the uh, have the effect on it so that's a pretty cool tip if you didn't know that but yeah, once you uh, drag in color curves, as you can see, if you play around with it, all it really is doing is making the clip darker or lighter, or whatever you want to do with it. Um, and let me go to a better spot in the clip so that you can see it better. There you go, that's good. Um, and that is because you're on the channel RGB, which is red, green, and blue. That's all of them together, and that's why it isn't really looking um, as good as it should. So if I go ahead and... Um, delete this add another reset to none in you can go to the channel and change it to red and then you can move red around you know make it look nice um, what I normally do is I try and stay away from red because it really doesn't doesn't look too good on any game actually so I like to use green and blue most of the time um, and Gears of War looks pretty good with a blue on it so if I go ahead and do this and then go to my blue and change it up a little um, and again you're gonna have to play around with this quite a lot to get some nice settings I think I'll take a lot of the green away um, you can as you can see it's starting to look kinda like purplish uh, which looks pretty nice in Gears of War um, and if we maybe maybe screw around with the red a little bit um, yeah, you can really, really, uh, screw around with this and get some really nice, uh, color corrections out of it. Now, if I go ahead and turn this off, that's how it used to look. If I turn it on, that how it, that's how it looks now. Um, and then with a couple other things, you can go ahead and make it look really nice. If you just go ahead and add in a levels, and you can either use one of the presets or just drag in a reset to none, and then put the gamma up or down, and you can get it a little darker so yeah that's pretty much it guys if you if I go ahead and turn this off that's how it used to look and this is how it looks now with the color correction so big improvement very little amount of stuff you had to do um, and again no paying for any big plugins or anything like that all built into Sony Vegas so thanks for watching guys I hope this helped um, and yeah I'll see you next time peace